really start with the crime. And I feel like the crime is the thing that holds it all together. And and here's the secret, we're not the first police show on TV. I, I know, surprise. We're not the first police procedural mystery show on TV. So coming up with clever crimes where our sophisticated audience, because many of them are mystery and crime buffs, doesn't halfway through say, I know who did it, I know who did it, means we have to really think through how do we set up a number of red herrings and at some point point, have the bad guy cross the frame and not have you say, she did it, he did it. The, the worst thing for me when I'm watching mysteries is to know in advance. We all love, we live to be surprised in mystery stories and, and that requires all of us collectively, six writers sitting there and tugging at the threads and trying to figure out if we tug at the thread is the whole thing going to come apart and, and that's tricky. It's like putting together a puzzle and so you begin at the beginning sometimes with an image or a crime and you slow build it and then you you retrofit you you reverse engineer if you will and you make sure that it all makes sense